Welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. In a recent video, I discussed a red hibiscus, which I've had for over 30 years. And I had a viewer request to show the entire plant, not just the flowers. I assumed to get an idea of their relative size. So I thought, well, let's do a video and show some of the other larger hibiscus that I have to give you some idea of how large they are. Most of the ones I grow are Rosa sinensis varieties, different colors, but they have a similar structure, growth habit, flower shape, and so on. One is quite unique. It's called Schizopetalus. It has a much looser branch structure and the flowers are a totally unique shape. So in this video, we'll cover several of the larger plants that I do have. They are all Rosa sinensis, different varieties. As luck would have it, none of the red or yellow ones are in flower today. But we do have the hot pink and the double flowered orange. This hibiscus I call hot pink. It's also around 30 years old. It's been trained to be more of a bushy shape, whereas a red one was trained as a standard, so it's taller and thinner. And this is the orangey peach double flowered hibiscus. It's a multi-stem plant. I've just allowed it to grow any which way it wants. And it's a fair sized plant. The plant is in the ground with the pot. So I'd say it's about five, five, five and a half feet. And it's fairly wide as well. For width, so this is that red hibiscus I was talking about. This is the plant. This is what the trunk looks like. I trained it as a standard tree, and then after several years. One spring I put it out too early and it got hit by frost. So this major branch died back and only recently I've just let it grow to whatever shape it wants. This is the trunk of the 30 year old red hibiscus. This is the seed grown yellow hibiscus. It's a clear yellow flower. Here's another view of that clear yellow hibiscus. Here's a close up of the trunk. And here's a close up of the leaves. The leaves are substantially different from other hibiscus. Notice the lack of serrations. This is a close-up of the red hibiscus leaves. Notice the serrations. This is hibiscus, schizopetalus. I would say it's just over six feet tall. Has a very loose branch structure. I'll show you a close-up of what the branches look like. This is a more typical Rosa sinensis. Well, I hope this has answered your question. If there are any other plants you want me to elaborate on or discuss, please leave it in the description below. Until next time, thanks for watching and happy gardening.